Who knew what $30 could do for me? You know, all those production people with all their fancy setups, this is really just something that I'm doing for me. Well, also, I mean, this video is in response to a conversation I had with a special someone, and that special someone will know. They will know. As an adult, I have to always like split my time between being responsible and playing video games. And more recently, I've had a, a video game spree where I've been playing Elden Ring. And this game really just like beat me into the floor aggressively, non-consensually. And I kind of liked it. You see, there's something about making incremental progress in a arbitrary world that has no real meaning in real life that really just that really just gets me going at first you know it was a mario legend of zelda and now margaret the fell omen is is deceased and you know why because when he brought down that hammer i showed him what for and there's just something really nice about that now you see the game really just got me and then i was playing it for like a whole week straight and i got to one little blip one tiny one tiny little one tiny little change one tiny little you know it's not going to be easy anymore and then my brain was like well time to move on to something else i suppose and so i moved on and then i played through tunic and now it's february and i still got some goals but uh, we, we kind of, you know, we, we played some games and so we had some fun. But now I suppose it's time to, um, now I suppose it's time to get back to it. And um, yeah, that, that's what I got to say about that. And so vlogs are probably one of the oldest forms of, of documenting known to a Gen Zer. And so I have some inspirations I'd like to to shout out. Um, the first would probably be Jake Roper. Jake Roper is near and dear to my heart. Vsauce three, all of his video game different questions. He's kind of like a lesser known version of game theory. That's what his channel was game theory but i watched all of his vlogs a lot i loved his um let's talk about it i loved his um he went through a journey he actually had cancer and you know he was just very real whenever he was on the camera and i loved that a lot about him so jake roper what a star and then um vlog brothers who are just hank and john green have gone through a whole adventure throughout their entire lives just posting every Tuesday and every Thursday, something, Tuesday, Friday. I don't know the actual cadence, but once a week, each of them have to make a vlog that is by definition four minutes or less, unless there are, there are a couple of rules and they have broken rules a couple of times. So those two are very, very big, very big inspirations to me. And, you know, they're kind of leading me to work on this whole content creation get myself out on the internet thing it's uh it's it's great and it's it's real crazy how all those self-help youtubers and instagram people they always say the most basic stuff but sometimes they're just right like you know everybody says that they love to travel and it's kind of basic and it really is bake it but basic but here's the thing is that i like to travel and it's cool and it's fun and it's basic like a mocha venti latte two pumps caramel one scoop of whipped cream don't forget the cherry but remove the stem and tie a knot in it basic and so normally i would i'll try and just not do what what everybody else does but you know here's the thing with traveling is that 
traveling is too broad of an umbrella because like traveling it just means going somewhere like traveling has this magical thing behind it but it's like oh no i just like going to other places then well yeah everybody likes going to other places who doesn't like going to other places gremlins well good for them but as for me and myself we will travel and so with that being said I'll see you on the flippity flop.